a hopefully this will continue video videotaping okay everyone this is the house I grew up in I'm now in Ontario and uh, boy they really fixed this house up it was really starting to show you know a lot of wear and tear but they really fixed it up but uh, it's it's changed quite a bit uh, the house the same same shape you have the garage and stuff uh, but when we lived here in the 1970s, uh, we had a lot of ivy that went around, around over here. We had two big trees up here and uh, a couple of hedges in the end. The driveway wasn't as wide as it is right now. Um, this is a great house. It's a party house. I would love to be able to go inside and see the inside. Uh, the windows are different uh, now from what they were when we lived in when we lived here. Uh, we had the kind of windows that you would uh, twist, you know, uh, turn a knob, and the windows would open out. And there, were, uh, the frames were brown. The house was great, and we. Uh, had it stuccoed. Yeah, I see somebody moving around in there. And, uh, and, um, put a, put a new roof on it. You said about wood shingle roof. They changed the fireplace. The chimney was all brick, you know, red bricks. Yeah, they changed, changed it quite a bit. They made some, a lot of changes here. Still a great house. Lived here from 1972 to 1981. And... I think that's Patty Cork back there. I think it is. There's a vehicle still in there. And the Corks lived there. Sanchez has lived over here. Nice people. Let's see if I can get this up here. And they're ready for the 4th of July, looks like. Yeah, and it was such a great neighborhood, but they cut down way too many trees. And, uh... They got rid of the palm trees. That's good. I didn't like having palm trees in the yard. But, um... Uh, this was such a great house. Great pool in the backyard. Really neat. Not a great memories. Okay, on to our next stop, which is going to be uh, Bynadanks Junior High School.